This is a very old painting, nearly 400 years old. Now I'm sure that you've seen a lot of old paintings, but there's something special about this one. Actually, this is not canvas, it's glass. The oldest item in Tehran's Museum of Reverse Glass Painting that hosts a collection of 450 works dates back to the Safavid era, when the art was introduced to Iran. Not to be mistaken with stained glass, which is painting on top of a piece of glass, reverse glass painting consists of painting pictures behind it, so that you would have to look at it through the glass. Now, in order to find out more about reverse glass painting, I'm here to meet an artist who specializes in this field. One of the most sought after works of art, mainly because the glass protects the painting. This art form was widely used for sacral paintings since Middle Ages, and also when it later spread to Italy and then to Iran. But as you can see, today artists are taking a more modern approach. This work is hard, but it is easier in the process. Because it is hard to see that the first color is the real color of the work. یعنی وقتی که داریم کار میکنیم تمام سایه روشنی که داریم میزنیم اون حجمی که داریم درست میکنیم در حقیقت اولین لایه ای هستش که کسی که داره کارو میبینه چشمش در حقیقت اون قسمت رو داره نگاه میکنه یعنی لایه اول و اگر اشتباه توش رنگ بذاریم دیگه قابل جبران نیست یعنی اگر از اون ورش شیشه یه نمای دیگه ای داشته باشه ما بعد بتراشیم کارو دوباره از اول کار بکنیم Sima Azimi has taken up the challenge, though, painting, as she puts it, inside out, with her naturalist approach to even the most traditional of Iranian designs, gulumor, or a flower and bird. Starting with the smallest details, artists would normally be taken care of when they're almost done with a stroke of the brush. It is the artist's patience and humility that helps her create these timeless masterpieces. For those who prefer two-dimensional traditional Iranian motifs, there's also plenty to choose from. The popular round-faced doe-eyed lady with joined eyebrows known as Khorshi Khanum or Miss Sun, as well as many religious elements make these works unique. نقاشی پشت شیشه از بندر ونیز وارد طبق روایتی که هست وارد ایران میشه و حالا با اون در حقیقت میتونیم بگیم هنری که هنرمندایی ما داشتن یه تلفیقی در نقاشی پشت شیشه ایجاد کردن که تونستن توی معماری های ایرانی حتی استفاده کنن بعضا بعضی از موارد دیده شده که تابلوهای از شاهزادگان یا دوره ناصر دین شاه قاجار و حتی دوران زندی که به اوج شکوفایی خودش میرسه استفاده می شده. Reverse glass painting has had its ups and downs in Iran, at times being considered a luxury art favored by royalty or falling into oblivion for a while. But it has always been a form of religious expression, and today certainly revived as a popular art form with many art apprentices wanting to master the skill. حلوش بگم شست ساله کارم اینه اولین تابلو هم سال چهل و دو به فروش رفت من باعث افتخاری که بتونم یه جوان ها رو به این هنر آشنا کنم جون و دلن داریم زحمت میکشیم با امید خدا با امید خدا هر ایرانی بتونن یکی از این تابلو ما تو خونه چین داشته باشن
In Iran, art and religion have always had a very close relationship. Probably reverse glass painting is a perfect example of that. Gisumisha Ahmadi for Iran.